Hello and happy Monday everybody. I hope you're all okay and had a lovely weekend and it's now time for our phonics. Are you ready to start? La 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 Ready? A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. A, B, C, D, E, F, G, H, I, J, K, L, M, N, O, P, Q, R, S, T, U, V, W, X, Y, Z. La 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 <laughs> Well done you. So last week, hmm, what letters did we do? Can you remember? We had this one. Ah, well done. We had this one. T. Fantastic. We had this one. K. Well done. And we had this one. S well done. So for today, we are looking at two more letters. Are you ready? The first one is this one. Hmm, what's this one? It's one of my favourites. <laughs> are you ready? My name is M, but I sound like... Well done. Mm, we rub our tummies, don't we? Mm, fantastic. My name is M, but I sound like mm, fantastic. Well done. Now, the next one we're looking at is this one. Well done. My name is P, but I sound like fantastic. I can hear that really pure, soft sound. P. Well done. Fantastic. No purr. Don't want that, do we? Just a real soft p. Fantastic. Now, again, I have found some things in my house and we are looking to see if we can hear our m mm at the beginning or our p at the beginning. So let's start with, start with this. Now, it's a bit of a clue because this one actually has some letters on it. <laughs> It's my milk, milk. Hmm. Does that start with my m for milk, or does it start with my p for milk? I don't think I can hear a p in milk. Can you? It starts with my m milk. Fantastic. Right. Let's try another one. Ooh. If it wasn't so early, I would eat this right now. Whoop. <laughs> what could it be? Yes, it's my pizza. Pizza. Ooh, <laughs> so does my pizza start with a mm, mm, pizza? Or does it start with my p pizza? Pizza. You're right, it starts with my p doesn't it? It's really hard to hear the sound at the beginning of this one because it's so soft, which is why it's important we say our p sounds soft. Pizza, pizza. Fantastic. Right, let's have another one. Oh, I'm going to sound this one out to see if you can hear the full word that I'm trying to say. Are you ready? P -ig. P -ig. P -ig. Pig! <laughs> Here is my little cheeky pig. Now, can we hear m mm in pig? 
or can we hear our p in pig? Yes, well done. Our pig starts with our p pig. Fantastic. Let's have a look. Oh, I'm going to sound out another one now. And this one is going to trick you as well because it uses both of my letters. But I want to know which one is at the beginning of this word. Now, let's see. Mop. 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 Can you hear it? Yes, it's my little mop. Mop, 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 mop. Let's give you a good clean. <laughs> Here is my mop. Now, which letter can we hear at the beginning, the start of my word? Can we hear a m for mop? Or can we hear a p at the beginning of mop? You're right, I tried to trick you. It starts with m, doesn't it, for mop? If I asked which letter comes at the end of mop, It'd have to be the p, wouldn't it? Because it uses both. Oh, just to confuse you on this Monday morning. Well done. We have got our m for mop. Fantastic. So let me put these on my board now and we can see which ones start with our m and which ones start with our p sound. So here we go. I have got my pig and my pizza in my p one and I've got my milk and my mop in my m section. So have a look around your house again today and don't forget to send in photos. Have a go at writing those tricky letters m and p and see if you can split them up in the right ones. Have fun and I will see you again tomorrow. Bye! <laughs>